I don't even know how to even how to start this video, man. Ever since I like started my journey, I've always like guided myself based off of quotes that I see on Instagram or just like lines that I uh, read on books. So for example, the title the title of today is where there's a well, there's a way. What I really mean to say by that is that there's just like moments where we want to do like so much things at the same time, but we just can't seem to find a way to do them. So lately, I've been like a firm believer that if you really want to do something, you're going to find every existing way there is to for you to do so. Because I remember that when I came to the U.S., like to the United States, I came with the mentality of me, like putting in all the effort in the things that I wanted to pursue. When I first came here, I wanted to like, just like practice or just get myself, like get involved with something that was like related with, with uh, culinary arts. Um, I just started like searching and searching and searching. I just like, like read a bunch of magazines, bro. You know, I also went and asked for information in in uh in every single campus or school or college that was like close to my vicinity. The reason why I'm sharing this with you guys because in the beginning I just couldn't uh, sign up to any college. Well, I mean, I could, you know, but like, since I wasn't like a resident, I had to pay like a large amounts of money per unit. Uh, or like per class, you know, because like the tuition is like very different for a resident like compared to someone who is not a resident. So I had like two options. I had the option of like working any kind of job, but at least just doing something while I complete like my residency or I could just like try to find at least something, you know what I'm saying? Like something that was at least related to what I wanted to do uh, career-wise, you know? If you really want something, you're gonna search for it by any means. So lately, I've been trying to find a way, I've been trying to strategize, you know, how to put out more, more videos on my YouTube. You know, I've been also trying to learn more about how to increase the quality of my videos, uh, how to like edit, how to color grade. So what I'm saying is that, you know, so all those things that I just mentioned, you know, I feel like that's where like investing in yourself takes part. Because I've noticed that if you wanna like get better at color grading, a video or just like editing you know like but with a good software like most of the applications or most of the programs that are out there that offer like a good quality result you're gonna have to pay for them man you know what i'm saying and i feel like the you know like there's just people and there's just situations in life where you just can't be like chubbing away money so the so the way that i see it is that right now i'm gonna try my my best to use the equipment and the programs that i have that are like either free or i just don't have to pay a lot of money for them but anyways man i'm about to finish this video up i guess you know the real message behind this video is that you know if you really want something bro don't lie to yourself, man. You know, just don't lie to yourself. You know, be real with yourself, man. Be honest. You know, like, if you feel like you're not putting enough effort, man, try your best. You know, just try your best, man. You know, I feel like at, in the, at the end of the day, I feel like the secret to success is pretty pretty damn obvious you know i don't even know why we're like always looking at videos on youtube i don't know why, why we're like always like listening to people man you know what i'm saying like what i'm trying to say is that 
I'm not trying to say that you already know everything, you know, but I feel like the fundamental, like the basic stuff, like the basic things for success are have already been told by us, you know, since forever, man. You know, you need to apply yourself, man. You know, try your best to call distractions, man. I, you know, I, I'm still dealing with this shit, man. You know what I'm saying? But, you know, the first step to solving a problem is identifying there's one. That's, I, I didn't say that, bro. You know, I didn't say that. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't know who said it. I just heard it. You know, I'm not taking any credit for that from Blackwood. I'm, I'm just putting it out there, man. You know, there's some truth to it. I'm telling you guys. But, yeah, man, you know, just get up, bro. Just get up and do stuff, man. Come on, man. I know you can, bro. Come on, man. 